Well, the Utica Comets gear up for three games in the next four nights at home, beginning tomorrow night against the Syracuse Crunch, who they just beat twice in Syracuse last weekend. The team was back at practice today ahead of the annual Save of the Day Charity Week at the Adirondack Bank Center. At 33 and 11 this season, the Comets sit comfortably atop the North Division, 17 points ahead of the second place Toronto Marlies. They're currently fourth in the league due to points percentage. Utica comes off a dominant weekend where they outscored Syracuse 13 to 7, including putting up an eight spot in the first of the back to back on Friday. Nine different players found the back of the net last weekend with eight different goal scorers on Friday. That type of balanced production is exactly what the Comets hope will make them a tough team to play against as we continue to get closer to the playoffs. Eight goals, but uh, there are a couple empty net netters uh, mixed in there at the end of it. Uh, when you look back at your stats during the summer, a lot of players go, I don't know if there's any empty netters on there. So we've talked about our, our depth and we've talked about contribution throughout uh, our lineup. And uh, when you score eight goals and eight different players score, I think that's a good reflection of that. But I thought we got a good start, especially that second game. Um, and it seems like our team all year, if we score a couple early, like the floodgates can really open up. And our whole lineup's really deep. You get scoring up and down all four lines. So um, when all the guys are feeling it and going, it's, it's pretty scary for the other team. The Comets have now won eight of the 10 Empire Recycling Cup contests against the Crunch this season. They'll host Syracuse tomorrow night before facing Toronto and Rochester on Friday and Saturday.